So as a physics teacher, I hear a lot about how to figure out how far away lightning is. So for example, if you see lightning and then you count, one, two, three, and after four seconds you hear the thunder, and the question is how far away was the lightning? And I've heard things like for every one second that means one mile, or every 10 seconds is one mile, every two seconds is one mile, something like that. Okay, so let's figure this out, but first we're gonna do some physics review. Lightning, so what is lightning? What happens is you get positive and negative charges collecting in places, negative charges on the lower levels of the atmosphere, and then the positive charges on the ground are attracted to that, and eventually the force is strong enough that the charges move, they exchange, and that's lightning. It's the same thing that happens when you get a static electricity shock, when you touch a uh, light switch or something like that, and it gets very, very hot. As a matter of fact, it gets almost five times the temperature of the sun's surface, and that produces uh, light and it produces sound. And so the light gets to you in a time of, in a speed of three times 10 to the eighth meters per second. That's 186,000 miles per second. It's very fast. So you see the lightning almost immediately. And then it takes time for the sound to get to you because sound travels a lot slower. As a matter of fact, sound travels at 344 meters per second, right? As opposed to 300 million meters per second like we just saw. In terms of miles, that's 0.2 miles per second. So that means the thunder, the sound of the lightning, is coming to you at a speed of 0.2 miles per second, or about a fifth of a mile per second, and that means one mile for every five seconds. So for every one second, that's a fifth of a mile. Back to our original question then, if it took four seconds for the sound of the thunder to get to you, then that would mean that it's four-fifths of a mile away. 